Okay, so for those of you who missed the beginning of the game, I can just get, show this off real quick. This is the, uh, if you're playing as a female character, you're not really supposed to, to leave this area, but speaks an incomprehensible language. What? Hey, do you speak English, Savage? English yells a lot more to you of something incomprehensible. I e o speak speak English little. Well, fuck off then. Leave, <laughs> man. You all you drink with me in other I incomprehensible. Take offense, strong. Are you insane? No, I've got an ulcer and I um I gave up. Hey, uh, yesterday morning. Bye, Alki. Leave. No, he gets up and he just straight up murders me. And that's a scripted event, by the way. So, it's a scripted event. That's the way that starts. You're not supposed to be able to leave normally. There is no other direction to go. You will always get this one dialogue. There might be a, and I have speech tagged as well. There might be other, I'll have to check his script if that's possible. There might be other ways to get around him. But as far as I know, the only way to get around him as a female is to simply go into attack mode. And then just run all the way over to here, and maybe a couple steps down, and then BAM! Now he just falls over over and again. And you can just save it here, and just run out. Yeah, okay, you know what else we can do? Oops, well don't get too close where he can see you, because then you'll still die. Over here, about there I think. And run up to here, and then as long as you're, as long as the box is between you and him, you can just go over and grab all his booze and all that stuff. And then the other thing you can do, because I thought this was pretty cool, is just go into attack mode, run right up to him, take a well-aimed punch to the head, and then hopefully you'll hit him. If you miss him, you're going to have to reload, because that ain't going to work. Ah, come on, dude. This is this is why I like to save scum. There we go. That did not give me the crit I needed. That's okay, though. Let's try again. Nope. Nope. I wish I had one more action point. Oh, come on. There we go. There we go. Man, he, he is not one of the locals. Was critically hit in the head for 15 hit points. Damaging attack and accent knocks him unconscious. And then guess what you can do? You just walk up. Oh, okay. Hold on. Uh, what? That wasn't what I wanted to have happen. He's supposed to be unconscious. Yeah, he is unconscious. He can still just take his stuff. There we go. <laughs> He's still unconscious. He's just got. <laughs> can I like? No, I can't do anything else with him. But anyway, now once you've taken his stuff, now you can actually begin the game. Ah, oh, thanks, fella. You're pleased to wander, and I wanted to shoot you when I met you. Well, too late now. I took your gun from you, even though you kind of have it still, <laughs> which is visually. Anyway, uh, looked with an unfavorable eye at the acquainted, acquainted stranger. Hey, right, stop making faces. Just a joke, okay? Now listen. I can't help you with your problem, but I can at least give you some advice. Ignore the headache and try to look attentive. If you're looking for a secret and very expensive device, you better head straight to Sidorovich at Cordon. He is a born fence, and he's, in, he's into exactly such thingies. Continue listening. You really need that? What is that stuff? A uh, gek? Yeah, right. Well, you can ask at Nubar. That hole is on a crossroad, so it's kind of a rumor center. Or you can try the bandits junkyard. Their line of work obliges them to know about goings on. And what about you? I thought you might help me with my search. Listen, no offense, you're a cool savage, funny and all that, but you have your quests and I have mine. Farewell then, maybe we'll meet again. Watch the stranger with your eyes as he departs southward while you have his gun and his booze. And you get to keep them both.